Hey guys, we're at the thrift store today. I have a good feeling about today for some reason. Things on my list that I actually wrote down on my like notes app. Um, like plaid pants, for instance, is something that I'm looking for. Like oversized plaid pants, um, trouser pants, a herringbone jacket, preferably from the men's section or just the women's and have it be like an oversized fit. Um, and then a pantsuit, like striped pantsuit, like pinstripe, you know? I feel like that could be fun. I have like an idea to do a like a DIY kind of like upcycling kind of thing and so I'm looking for a pair of jeans maybe for that or two or three because they all actually involve jeans so I kind of had like a gut feeling I was like Jordan you need to go to the thrift store and so I'm here and so hopefully that was like my gut telling me there are good things here and for some reason I wanted to go to this specific one which is further away from me than my normal ones so let's go in and see what we can find found this hat section like a whole hat section with handmade knit hats which are like my favorite knit hats kind of ever um to find especially because they're starting like the best ones and so like for instance that cute i love the colors this one has like a little pom-pom on it love that one but the issue is is that my head is always so big Okay, I'm not messing around today. <laughs> I'm going straight to the places that would have my list items. I'm like, is she not gorgeous? Like also, oh my god. Also, another goodie. I always love these from the men's section specifically. A great thing if I didn't have that. Love the color. Mm, not quite. Okay, I already have a pair like this, but these. They're a great pair of overalls, are they not? Like with the white stitching, I love these. A really good stripe. I don't know if you can tell, but the coloring and the stripes on it are great. I don't need another button up, but this is good. I love this. I love how I think it would fit. And it has like this embroidery, like it has this patch on it, which I think I could seam rip off. I'm gonna hold on to it and just like think about it, conjure it, you know? You guys, please look at what I just found. Look at that blazer, right? With the little, with the fringe on it. I love the color, love the plaid. And then a matching pair of pants. I think that would be so cute. That would be literally just so cute. Size 10, but I love it. How good is that? I love that. I mean, I don't mind the beads, but I would prefer it without. But I love how sweet that is and the movement that it has. Amazing. The arms specifically. I just saw a pair of pants this morning that looked just like this. If you can see, obviously these are like a very common pajama pant. I feel like I see a lot, um, but I love that. Here, I don't know why, but I always love these like fruit of the loom like thermal things, like the top on them for some reason. I don't know. How cute is this pajama dress? <laughs> I think it's so cute. Kind of love this. The texture and the little buttons. I love, love those buttons. So cute. And the colors. It's great. In my opinion, color. I know it's kind of like I'm loving a shade of like yellowy green. My gut was right and telling me to come today. You guys, the state of my cart right now. I need to go to the fitting room and try a couple things on. Also, if you guys thrift a lot, which a lot of you guys do, I know. You've heard me talking about like the phone case like thing like this, crossbody. And I keep wearing it. And I today is my first time thrifting with one. And I'm like, this makes it so much easier because for some reason I always put my phone everywhere at the thrift store and I start freaking out because I'm in the thrift store more than I am most other store. I really have that problem at like Kroger and stuff. But anyway, so just wanted to say, I got this one off of eBay. I'm pretty sure. I'll link it down below if I did. But anyway, um, so I'm going to go to the fitting room try I just want to try a couple things on that all of the things that I might get um, but but this is the state of my cart right now I have a lot of really good things some color like this I don't know I might try this on because I'm not sure how I'll like it and I just don't know if I'd really grab for it ever but I love the color and I love that it's like knit you know like a really fine knit um, and thick too so we'll see okay we are in the the fitting room. No, that's the word. Um, this is my outfit. Super comfy. At least it says got sweater, the sherry cardigan, I believe it's called. And then this was thrifted at uh, eBay or something. And then this little Target tank or uh, t-shirt. Love that. Donnie Terry cloth sweatpants. And then my little ASOS loafers that I never wear and I should more often. I didn't notice that Rex ate through my sock until I got here. So anyway. All right, trying the coats on really quickly. What do we think? This is the little Hound's tooth. I like it. However, I think I would want it like, like bigger and longer, but it's very pretty. 
Sexy, right? What do you think? I think it's a no, but it is really pretty. I think the same for this, but like look how good the details are on it. You can see that like, but I can't really. I think it's terrible, but this is so cute. I wish it was like one or two sizes bigger. It would have been perfect, but um, but again, the details are so just great. Something is drawing me to this. I love the little designs on it. And it's like this velvet, so cute. I probably wouldn't reach for it as much, so I'm not going to grab it, but it is so sweet to me. You guys, I kind of just like blanked and stopped filming in like the middle of the thrift store because I was in shock. I was gonna leave. Okay, so I feel like sometimes this has happened to me before when I'm like, okay, I'm gonna leave, I give up. I wasn't like totally satisfied. Like I was, but I wasn't, you know what I mean? And suddenly I found like five things right in a row that I was like, I definitely looked in these spots already, but these things are like things that are on my wish list. So I literally found, this is one of my best thrift hauls in so long. And so this was just like a mini thrift with me, I guess. I don't know how much footage I got. And then I got two bag, big bag fulls of things. And like I said, these were all on my wish list for thrifting. And you guys know my thrift hauls are usually at the end of these videos. I like teeny. And this one is pretty big. So I'm excited to show you guys what I got because all of these things, again, I've been on the hunt for. So, so the first thing being, I feel like I've been talking about this for so long, but um, a leopard print or cheetah print, whatever, furry jacket. Look at this. And I found them before at the thrift store, but they've never fit me correctly. And this one is just like so good in every single way. Boulevard East or East Boulevard. And it was $30. I've been trying to find the right one on like eBay and Mercari and everything. So this is so good. It's so soft. It fits me perfectly. I've been pinning these nonstop on Pinterest for the last like three years. And that's probably how long I've waited to find one of these. And um, the collar is so cute on it too. I'm just like so freaking stoked about it. Like I feel like something like this, you can easily dress up, dress down, that kind of thing. Sorry, I'm, am I yelling? Forgot my ears were covered itching for cheetah print in my life lately. I don't know what it is about it, but especially like with my silver metallic pants, I feel like this kind of jacket is going to be so cute with that. And I'm very excited to style this more with you guys. Um, I, I want to do like an outfit idea video soon and that's perfect. This is literally perfect. Okay, next, this one is kind of boring, but it's kind of like also necessary for me personally. I always grab like if i can find like a really good crew neck sweater um or sweatshirt this one's my members mark and it's was six dollars it's plain gray but it's just like one of those perfect like layering pieces literally i have so many good things that i don't even know which bag to pull from i'm seeing like okay i'm gonna go for this one because this one was like such a i don't know like i, I just i didn't know about it and i went and i tried it on it's this zara i feel like you guys are either going to like love or hate this but i i, I didn't know where i stood when i was in the store until i tried it on and I loved the fit of this so this reminded me of something from Ghani um like one of their polka dot dresses and it's it is a mini dress I'm going to wear it as like a mini dress slash shirt or like top you know it's just like this baby doll style and if you can see up close there are actual sequins on it like it's filled with sequins which is what made me so skeptical about it and I was like I don't know I'm not like super into sequins but at the same time why not it's fun. I'm into the sparkly stuff right now and it definitely brings me back to middle school But I'm really excited to challenge myself and play around with it again This is from Zara. It's new with tags and it's a size large So I was so unsure if it would fit but it fits. It's a little tight around the boobs, but that's okay it's Really hard for me to pass up anything uh, polka dot print because it's just it's one of my all-time classics that literally I never get sick of polka dots So I thought that was pretty safe to play around with with the sequins and stuff I don't know. Okay next I feel like I've mentioned quite a few few times how much I'm into like capes and like I don't know if what would you call this cape a poncho I'm gonna say like more of a cape here let me put this over my I'm wearing um my robe right now and my pajamas because I was like I'm gonna do my try on over top of it and, and I'm filming this on uh Sunday Super Bowl so this is my Super Bowl outfit anyway this is by JG Hook and you know how at the beginning I was mentioning a herringbone print coat well I found this and it's a herring can you see there you go it's a brown herringbone it's beautiful it reminds me of like of Mary Poppins and I just think it's so sweet and I think that this is going to go so well I've been really into like the very tonal outfits of like 
different shades of brown and black and creams together and different like textures within that so I think this is going to be so so great for it I do not know about these I did not try these on but these were kind of like a toss-up because I was like you know what I if if they don't fit I have an idea of an I upcycle DIY I want to do with them um, but they're these cargo pants and they are definitely a little bit big for me I think and so I was thinking if they don't fit correctly I've been like dying over like the cargo skirts and I was like I feel like I can make this into a maxi skirt pretty simply and I think that that would be even cuter so I'm gonna just play around with these and see like how I feel if I want to keep them as pants if I want to make them into a skirt I'm kind of like in the mindset of like I'm really into DIYing right now and I need to pull out my sewing machine and play around and so I feel like that could be fun to play around with they were five dollars next I forgot to give these to Jared I got him these Uniqlo um, jeans because I love Uniqlo in general like they're especially their jeans I feel like they have good jeans and he's never tried them and so I saw these and I was like they're literally a size they're size 32 and um, they're gonna be so cute on him they're dark wash straight leg I forgot to give them to him so on my wish list at the beginning or mentioned at the beginning I've been wanting like oversized trousers baggy trousers don't have a lot of like gray things I feel like in my life. I feel like I just never grab for them when I'm like shopping, like gray pieces, I guess. And these, I just, I don't know, like, they're just like a simple workwear pant. And I felt like they could be really good for like everyday style and, they, and also new with tags. So um, I'm thinking with like ballet flats could be really cute too. Uh, and I'll, even like the cape that I got, I don't know. It's again, staying in that like tonal with the, mixing the gray with brown, I really like. This skirt, I just couldn't pass up. First of all, it's really, really soft. I don't know what it's made out of, but it's super off it's Liz Claiborne I don't know but it's just this gray knit skirt it's like super fine knit um, it's like thick, but not too thick it's like has a good weight to it you know it's not too long it's not like a maxi or a midi length but it's also not a mini so I thought I don't know I think this could be fun to play around with proportions with um, with socks and like belly flats as well I don't know again I just it was in really good condition Next, I mentioned I was on the hunt for plaid pants and uh, I found these ones and I really like them pattern on them they're green and they're pretty and I want these to wear with sweaters I don't know I preferred them to not have like the elastic waist but honestly I've not been tucking my stuff in lately so you wouldn't even really know the top goes over the uh waist or anything but anyway these kind of pants are just so comfy to me I always grab them when they are in my closet I have like a ton of them I mean next is just a simple black blazer but I saw it on there was a guy going through because it was the end of the week and they did, were doing like their um where they pull out the things that they were gonna get rid of that didn't sell. I grabbed it off his rack because I was like, wait, that looks really long. And I love really long blazers, especially to wear with like black tights. Joseph and Fies, I don't know. It was $8. And again, it has shoulder pads. It's like not super structured and it's not double breasted. It's just your simple, plain black blazer. And honestly, I just liked the way it fit me. I think I can really layer a lot under there as well. And so I was like, I can't let this good of a blazer be taken to wherever they take the unwanted items. Okay, next, this is from the maternity section, and I can't find any, any like, showcase of it being maternity, but um, it's by Morning and Bright, and it's just this, like, white and red, like, candy cane striped turtleneck. And again, I really like layering these kinds of things under things, um, under, like, sweaters and under, under jackets to give, like, a little pop of fun. You guys know I love my stripes. And um, this one was just really soft. It feels like, you know, like the LuLaRoe leggings. It feels like that. But anyway, that's all that I have. That's, I mean, it was a lot of things, but I ran through it kind of quick because I didn't want to keep it too long. But like I said, I'm going to do a uh, alpha video, so I'm sure you'll see some of these pieces in that soon. And I am so happy. Like I said, I had like the inkling to go to the thrift store, and sometimes I get that and I leave empty handed. This was like everything on my thrift wish list lately, so I'm super excited. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and being here. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you were okay with it being a super short little thrift with me section. And yeah, so now I'm going to go style them so that I can do the overlays because I'm really inspired by these pieces. So I'll talk to you guys next time. Make sure you're subscribed if you're not already. If you like these thrifts with me, I also have other videos on my channel if you are new here. And uh, yeah, I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.